Brandon Olstead with Kloss of America. Part of my role in the marketing department is to travel the United States of America for different trade shows and events. And as I'm traveling, driving past cornfields, wheat fields, ranches, and dairies, I'm reminded of just how important the Farm Bill is to our producers. It gives them the confidence and reassurance to invest in the latest and greatest uh, farm equipment to allow them to be the most productive for their operation. So I'm going to go out, I make America, and I'm going to take you with me as we travel this great nation, and we're going to hear from some of these producers directly and hear just how important the Farm Bill is to them and their operation. You ready? Let's go. Charles Hammer, a corn, soybean, and wheat producer, shared his thoughts on the Farm Bill with Klaus. I would like to emphasize that uh, the agricultural production needs and would like to see good safety nets built in to the Farm Bill. Uh, as in fact as in uh, crop insurance and some of the other risk managements that we could use out here. Uh, as this year is shaping up, it's going to look like we're going to need to have the support of the uh, industry and the uh, government, uh, basically the politicians come by and uh, come with us and look at a safety net that's doable and can be uh, used in the future. Thank you. Farmer Andy Benson echoed the call to Congress for a farm bill with a strong safety net. Hi, I'm Andy Benson, uh, rural Dallas, Wisconsin, my son Abraham. Three most important things to me in the upcoming Farm Bill debate are, uh, number one, um, adequate government support of our uh, crop insurance industry. Uh, without adequate safety nets in the crop insurance industry, uh, uh, we just uh, have a hard time managing the risk of the marketplace and yields. Absolutely important to us. The second thing that's really critical uh, is adequate support for the foreign market development. And the, and the third thing that uh, is uh, critically important to me as our farm business grows, uh, we find ourselves uh, getting closer to the magic numbers where OSHA might be concerned about our activities. Congressman Lee Terry, who represents Kloss's district in the U.S. House of Representatives, recently visited the Kloss facility and spoke to employees about the importance of manufacturing, jobs, and America's agricultural community. I wanted to make a comment on the Make America program, because uh, frankly, and I was just talking to the world about this, that's been our weakness in our economy, literally for a decade or so. And it seems like every time we turn into an economic slowdown, we need more and more manufacturing jobs overseas. So when we have a class that actually is uh, an entity maybe in that headquarters somewhere else, but they set up manufacturing in the United States or any manufacturing set up in the United States, it's a big deal. So employees at Kloss hope that members of Congress will listen to their voices and the voices of the farmers they support and act on passing a farm bill. So you've heard from some of our farmers about the components of the farm bill that they value, such as safety nets and risk management tools. Now is not the time for procrastination, but it is the time for negotiation. And to pass a farm bill that is going to support the people that are tied to the land. 